Today, people across the country are rallying to keep post offices open. And Lindsay Shively is live in Westport at one of those rallies, one of many across the country, to say, keep my neighborhood post office open. That's right. Good afternoon, Krista. This is happening in front of uh, senators' offices, which is why we're in Westport. This is the office of Senator Claire McCaskill. Despite the weather, they have shown up for protest. I mean, few people know being out in the weather for their jobs better than the workers of the postal office and postal service, right? Uh, they're here because they want to fight the legislation that would be part of the reform. The post office says it's necessary. It would remove six-day delivery. It would also shut down a lot of post offices, and the people against it say lose a lot of jobs for for the middle class. The Post Service argues that they were $5 billion in the red last year, and this is something that they just happened to have to do. They just went inside to deliver a letter inside to Senator Claire McCaskill about why they are here. She's actually one of 22 senators that is also fighting for a different form of legislation that would keep rural post offices open for four years despite uh, this kind of legislation going through. So coming up, we're going to talk to the people that are here about why they're here and what they think should be done in all of this. For now, we're live in Westport. Lindsay Shively, 41 Action News. All right.